What's up, Get Better Basketball community? I'm Coach DeMarco, and this is Focused. In today's episode, I'm going to talk about something that you need to do more with your team to get easy baskets and put pressure on defenses, and that's 45 cuts. A 45 cut can happen a number of different ways, and I'm going to jump into it in a minute, and I'm going to give you an example on a baseline drive from the Arizona versus UCLA basketball game that happened recently. Now, a 45 cut is just what it says. It's going to be a cut from the wing, typically from this area into the paint, or this area into the paint, and it happens in different situations. It could happen on a baseline drive. It could happen on a post entry. It could happen on a pick and roll with a short roll. There's a number of different times it could happen, but the most common times it happens is on a baseline drive or some type of entry where you get the ball into the post and we 45 cut on the back side. Now these are particularly effective because they take advantage of the help defense and what the help is trying to do in these situations. So in the clip we're gonna see, we get a pass over to the wing and this two player is gonna have the ball on the wing. And they're gonna start to drive the baseline. Now that's gonna trigger these help defenders and it's gonna force the defense to adjust in general. We're gonna see from the help is this defender is going to slide over aggressively into the paint on this baseline drive. Almost a little bit of a, a double team or a trap on the baseline as this player gets into the baseline. Now this player has two that they're responsible for. They're going to slide down into this area and they're going to take away any type of pass. Hopefully they could come back out. So if the drive happened and they got stopped here and they kicked, this player would have to rotate out here and we probably would get uh, help the helper rotations out of that. So this defender is gonna slide down into this area. Now, as that baseline drive happens and we have our two player down here with the basketball, we have their defender and then the help defender sliding over, this player right here is gonna be our 45 cut. They're gonna cut right down at this angle to the basket. They're gonna get a pass from two and they're gonna get an easy basket out of it. This is a high IQ basketball play by Arizona in this situation, but this is something you can show your players on a baseline drive, these 45 cuts, these straight line cuts to the basket at a 45 degree angle are available. If you have a really good post player, that's another opportunity where you get it into the post and you cut on a 45 and they could potentially open up and hit this player. So let's take a look at this 45 cut from Arizona from a couple different angles. So here's Arizona with the pass to the wing and this player is gonna start on the baseline drive. It looks like this player is either replacing, maybe coming out to set a side ball screen, which he's already rejecting and he's attacking the baseline. We have our help defender, who we're going to see slide over into help position. And we have the help, the helper defender out here, who's responsible for two. Now, if that pass goes out to the corner, he's going to replace and help the helper, which he's anticipating in this particular situation to come out here. This player is already starting. This guy's got his back turned. This player has his back turned. So he's looking at the open space in the paint and he's thinking, I can cut right on a 45 degree angle and I should be able to get the basketball for an easy layup. So there they are. They're going to trap aggressively on the baseline. They're going to really stop his progress. This defender thinks, I'm going to cheat. I'm going to get a stale on this pass. This is a heads up play, high IQ play. This player is going to cut right into the paint. He's going to take away the help the helper defender, or his defender, who's going to take away this corner pass, and he's going to get an easy two points. Let's take a look at that one more time as we get the pass to the wing. You'll notice as soon as he drives the baseline, it triggers his 45 cut and an easy basket. Now I want to take a, a look at this from the aerial view because you're going to get a good look at this help defender. You're going to get the help the helper defender who's going to anticipate the pass to the corner, and he's going to start to cheat that way, and there's your 45 cut sneaking right in between. Now this Defender from the top, who's also helped, could have stepped in front and taken it away. He doesn't, and it's going to allow him to get an easy two points. Show this clip to your players and practice 45 cuts to get an easy basket on baseline drives. As you can see in the clip and in this diagram, 
when you get that help defense and they're cheating to that baseline on that baseline drive, they're thinking you're kicking, that 45 cut right into the paint is effective and can get your team easy baskets. Show your team this clip and this diagram and practice this with your players and you'll get a basket and a critical point of a game to help your team to potentially get a win. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button down below, turn on your notifications, subscribe to get better basketball for more great video breakdowns each and every week.